Excuse me. Waitress. Dude. Hi, what can I get you? We need some. Is that annoying? Is that obnoxious and rude? Would you find it distracting if someone did that to you while you were working? Oh, you don't have a job, sorry. <laughs> Damn, dude, she burned you. Oh. No. Hipster. No. Do not think we're on the same team. We have nothing in common. I wear knit hats when it's cold out. You wear knit hats because of cold play. <laughs> and finally, you think this is the sound that gets you service. I think this is the sound that dries up my vagina. <laughs> We need horseradish. Please. That, ladies, is how you treat a waitress. <laughs> Don't hire a new waitress, OK? I've been doing all the work anyway, and I really could use the extra money. You need help. I don't. I've been waiting my whole life, OK? I've waited on tables. I've waited in bars. I've waited on home pregnancy tests. I already hire a new waitress. Hi. Not to complain, but this mustard color doesn't really go with my skin tone, neither do the mustard stains. And these various other stains. And smells, I hope that's clam chowder. <laughs> Let's waitress. Whatever that is, it does not belong in this diner. It belongs in a show on Bravo. This is Max. Next up, great point. Well, I can cross that off my bucket list. She's a waitress. Hey, when you get a second, Stop looking at my boobs. This is Caroline. I'm a really fast learner. I went to Wharton Business School. Can you make a hot chocolate or not? <laughs> She's not. Nailed it. The only thing they have in common? Don't smile. Because it raises the bar and then I have to smile and I can't be doing that. It's exhausting and I have a bad back. They're broke. What are you, Martin Channing's daughter? You are not. The guy who ripped off the entire city is your father. You're like a billionaire. Was a billionaire. Do you know the president? I've met him. Do you have a horse? Yes. Do you know Paris Hilton? No, she's a hundred. <laughs> I really need this job, okay? We lost all of our money. Look at that. That girl is working harder than Stephen Hawking trying to put in a pair of cufflinks. So where do you live? Our townhouse was taken and bolted up by the bank. Is this where I'm supposed to feel sorry for you? A well-adjusted person, what? I'm dead inside. <laughs> you make that pretty obvious. Did you sleep on the subway? Ah, the chaser! <laughs> oh. Sorry, I didn't think it would hurt so much. It's pink. It didn't feel pink. I need a roommate if you want to crash. Bathroom, bedroom, boyfriend sleeps till four. Hello? Oh, hi. Who are you? I'm Max's friend. I'm Robbie. I'm uncomfortable. It's cool. Back up, Jersey Shore. <laughs> you deserve better than that guy. Oh, I was just starting to feel sorry for you. Max, Max, wait. Oh. Uh, yeah, I feel so good. Hi, honey, I'm home. I want you gone by the time I get back. Babe, I can explain. You weren't supposed to be home. <laughs> This isn't what I ordered. This is Caroline. She may have gotten your order wrong, but she does get some things right. Thank you. What'd you see in that guy, anyway? He had these muscle thingies. Oh, those things? Yeah. <laughs> I don't know what those are called, but they make smart girls stupid. Tomorrow we can go and get the rest of your stuff. Everything's locked up. Well, you have nothing that you care about that we can get? Well, there is one thing. <laughs> Don't get attached.